Hey guys, it's Haps, and in today's video, we are back with a Brotato, and I sort of want to finish off this top line, so we either go pacifist or generalist. You know what, let's just go generalist. So the generalist gives us plus two melee damage for every one range damage we have, and plus one range damage for every two melee damage we have. Now we can only equip three melee and three ranged weapons, so we've got to split it down the middle. In terms of weapon selection, we've got some melee and ranged. I think I'm going to start out with the spear though, because the spear's got pretty solid damage at 15, so I think the spear can hold its own early on. Let's jump in danger 5, and we're into the gold field. Now, for some reason, I feel like the gold field is one of my better maps. For no reason, like there's no reason it should be. I just, I don't know, it just feels like it is. <laughs> So hopefully we get a good result here. Oh, we nearly got both of those. Um, luck and harvesting is what I'm going to take early on. There's another spear. Let's roll. Jousting. I think we just run the spears for now, though. Roll again. There's another spear. A little bit of luck. Okay, so we've got three spears. We're maxed out on the number of melee weapons we can have. Um, happy to just pick up more spe spears if we see them, though. Take down the tree. Nice. So if we build out luck, I'm thinking by building out luck, we just increase our chance of finding better weapons um, or better level up stats. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to push that and harvesting when we see harvesting. Uh, let's roll, see if we find... We've got to take the HP there, though. Um, spear, shotgun. That is a ranged weapon. Let's roll. And there's some extra harvesting. We... Ah, oh, that's... I don't know. I don't like this, though, because we lose range damage and melee damage. Um, you know what? I think for 20, it's worth it. I think for 20, it's worth it. And by losing one melee, we lose half a range damage. So it's... It's not... It's not too much of a problem to get that back. And the extra harvesting... After three waves, it's already paid itself off, and then it's profit. Um, and I think it'll only take, say, let's say we had it for 10 waves. It's going to give us 200. We will be able to pay back that that melee and ranged and extra. So it's worth taking. It is worth taking. Uh, we'll take the harvesting here. And the ranged gives us melee as well, so probably worth having that. Okay, let's take you you we can't quite take the extra luck let's roll for four okay i'm happy to just hold this do we stick with the shotgun i don't know maybe not but uh we'll carry it for now clear you nice good wave clear though with the shotgun and the spears oh walk into those Good thing about the spear is it's a primitive weapon. We get a little extra HP buff off of having primitive weapons. I'll tell you what though, slingshot would be a good one to have. That's a primitive weapon. That could be pretty nice alongside the spear. Um, I'm going to roll and take either ranged or melee here. I think we'll take... I mean, it doesn't really matter because we're going to get the same from each one. So let's we'll just take the melee. Uh, we'll bring the spear in. Spicy sauce, always pretty handy. Let's roll the six. Another shotgun. Sure, yeah, we'll we'll just keep taking the shotgun. I mean, we could have taken the revolver there. I think if we find a rocket launcher, sniper rifle, or any really, really top tier stuff, then we'll take it. Now, I kind of want to find... We got the melee damage, we got the range damage leveled up a little bit. So any kind of luck and harvesting, back to taking that stuff now. HP's fine as well. We're 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 pretty good at this point. It's wave five. Fairly comfortable. We're controlling the middle of the map, which if I'm doing that then Yeah, no no problems here so far. We'll take the luck. That goes up to 15, it's pretty nice. Uh, let's roll. Harvesting, we'll take it. So we're going to bring the shotgun in. And then we actually have luck and luck. Okay, luck up to 35. Big. Uh, and 
this is actually really nice as well because we get and we get basically it's four melee and two range for one hp regen and we're locking this spear yeah we'll take both of those next time could have taken the spear then actually probably could have taken the spear then come to think of it definitely should have taken the spear then i didn't realize how much material i had left but it's not a problem it's just gonna take one space up in the shop it's not the end of the world we can we can look past that clear these guys we're gonna take you down focus the loot guy we want this we want oh yeah we get the item so good get in here maybe something from the tree Okay, 209, 46. I mean, damage, lose the armor. I'm going to recycle. You know what? Actually, no, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. We get the armor back straight away. Let's go. Okay. So let's bring this spear in. Let's get the hedgehog. Um, and we're going to roll the nine. I mean, this is actually pretty good because we get extra range. This is pretty, this is worth taking. Roll the nine. Hold the spear. We're not going to... I don't think we're going to take this because I don't think we're going to have any structures. Um, yep, this is fine. We're going to wave 7. Okay. I mean, we could have just rolled with minus 3 armor, which I'm not too keen on doing. Um, taking the armor there is pretty nice. We could have taken the range damage, which would have given us an extra plus 6 melee, which in reality is better than the armor there um but only i think it's only better if the armor's zero if you've got negative armor it's probably worth getting that back to back to flat or at least at least flat so we are back at flat zero which is good which means that the plus 25 from the glass cannon is such a nice pickup especially if we push the damage now and we can push our melee and range this is big we'll take the extra hp um and if these are all going to be like this we roll and we probably take range damage here because that gives us big melee damage increase attack speed happy to take that let's roll the 10 there's nothing here for us roll 13 armor some speed lose a bit of crit you know what? i'm not going to take that i'm looking for more ranged here Roll the 16. I don't really want this, though. Um, or the SMG. Roll 19. There's a shotgun. We'll take it. And you know what? We'll just take a little extra speed. A little extra speed doesn't hurt anyone. Well, actually, it hurts the aliens because now we're just quicker. <laughs> Technically, I guess it does hurt someone. Okay. Now we're pretty strong. Like, we've got decent amount of damage um especially with the spears that we've got would like to find more get a bit more luck because we have spent a bit of our luck um we have used it on some of the other item items that we picked up so yeah get that back up again hopefully use it to find like a rocket launcher or maybe a top tier ranged weapon just to kind of cycle out of these shotguns and then i think we're pretty good like extra attack speed and some dodge those kind of things maybe something to um heal ourselves with oh we got three items there extra range sure we'll take it attack speed range lose armor recycle hp lose a bit of dodge yeah we'll take the hp more hp as well okay this is big don't really want any of these though so we'll roll explosive turret hard not to take it hard not to take it i think we take you and you we'll lock the lure in for wave 10 yeah okay wave 9 we can't not take the explosive turret which means now that the improved tools that i denied earlier would have been a lot more useful but yeah an explosive turret here is huge it does 25 damage. It's just a little extra. It's like having a, a companion to help you out. 
can't really turn down such an elite item. So normally on wave 9, I like to try and get 400 plus material. So that's what we're pushing for. If we don't get that, I'm going to be disappointed. I've just, like, we've got a lot of HP. We're in a good place with HP. We're in a pretty solid place for damage as well. Um, just because of the melee and attack that we're getting every time that we're picking up one of the other. No way of healing though, except for picking up consumables. 495, that's what we like to see. Now, we can get more HP. I might just take the attack speed here. Um, this is more damage, which I'm just going to take. It's just better to take that. Bring you in and you in. Let's roll. More attack speed. Roll the 17. Combine the shotguns. Bring you in. Roll the 21. Range. Okay, we lose a bit of attack speed, but we gain... We would gain melee as well. I think it's worth it. And I'm just going to go into 10 here. I'm not going to take... I'm not going to spend the 75. So I think building out damage and building out crit could be the way forward. These shotguns are doing work though. Uh, we could get a top tier shotgun not too far from now. Okay, here's one of the loots. We got him. We took him down pretty easily. Now wave 10 sometimes causes me problems, but honestly, the shotguns, the shotguns are doing work. They're out there just doing some splash damage. And also the spears are pretty pretty solid as well. We've got our uh, elite turret down the bottom here doing some work too. There should be another loot boy there. There you go. Let's make sure that we get you. We spent money on making sure that you were part of this round. So we're going to make sure that we get maximum value. Try and get as much of this material as we can. Okay, 429. We left 95, though. Another would take it. Uh, not going to do this, though. That is what we like to see. <laughs> um, grinds Magical Leaf. So, plus 3 HP at the end of a wave. Plus 1 max HP regen at the end of the wave. And plus 1 lifesteal at the end of the wave. We'll take it. Engineering. This is pretty big for our turret. Hmm. But we're only going to have one turret. So the actual... I think I'm going to take the crit here. Now we could take... Oh, do we take the dodge and start building out the dodge? Do we take attack speed? I'm going to take the dodge. I'm going to start building the dodge. Um, okay, let's... Let's roll the 15. Extra crit. Maybe we build crit as well. Crit and dodge. Let's go. That's what we're looking for. Roll the 20. Shotgun, we'll definitely take. Uh, roll 25. Spicy sauce. And we roll 30. Pretty pricey, although this is huge. Because we're getting extra melee, extra HP, and we'll also get extra range damage. Harvesting less enemies, we'll save that for next time. Let's go wave 11. So we, could, we should get a couple more loot boys on this one. Because um, that was an item that we picked up. So let's keep an eye out for those. Really nice getting the getting the grinds magical leaf. Thank you very much for that. Always good to see. I do love that this game included content creator items. I think that's such a nice feature. Um, yeah, I think that's really you know, it's kind of showing uh, showing support to the content creators that have. Played your game and supported your game. I really like it. Okay, we want to make sure that we don't get caught out here. We're in a good place, but we are taking some some damage. We want a bit of health down here. Can we just get ourselves out of this, please? Bit of health. Let's get him next to our turret. Okay, we left a lot on the table again. We kind of got caught out over here. Piercing damage can't go above. I'm just going to recycle this. Extra from the consumables. More luck. We'll take it. Dodge lose a bit of armor. Sure, we can get the armor back at some point. I think the speed is huge. The melee damage, again, is pretty big. 
because this gives us range damage as well. I think we do take this. Big on the stick. Okay, harvesting. I'm a bit concerned that our armor could be negative if I take this, but I'm going to do it anyway. Um, let's take you. Let's roll the 21. Big on the spear. And let's go. Okay, wave 12, and we've actually just taken up. We're taking 12% more damage. But it's a it's a horde. It's not an elite. So I'm feeling, I'm feeling like we might be able to deal with the the sheer numbers. I could be wrong though. I could be wrong. So the extra 12% damage is not going to be fun. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Really not fun at all. That's uh, that's not good for me. That. That is, uh, that is not good. This is, if we survive this, this is going to be a huge, uh, a huge upset because there's no, I'm not feeling, I'm not feeling it right now. Just going to have to really concentrate on this. We have to rotate around here. Can we clear the gap down here? We can. We have to go back up though. Really pinned in, really pinned in, not fun at all. But somehow, somehow we managed to survive. I've managed to get some as well back there. 300 <laughs> left over. I think that's the highest I've ever had. Honestly, I think that's the highest I've ever had. Um, let's recycle this. We'll take this, sure. Uh, melee damage gives us more. That's pretty good. Okay, Spear's coming in. Lure is coming in for next turn. Enemies have a 20% chance to explode for 36. We lose some harvesting. I think actually that's worth holding. Let's take this and we'll roll for 18 because it's pretty cheap. We lose a bit of damage, but we gain attack speed and I think that's worth taking as well. Okay. So we need we need to take every bit of material that we get here. Because each one is going to be multiplied by two. We've got 300 to collect. So I need to go around collecting every single bit of material I find. We want it all. We should come out of this with, say, 600. And if we don't, then I've not done it properly. We should be strong enough to, to deal with it. It's not a horde. We should have the firepower. Down here. Play you. There's a lot of material. Good amounts. Let's get it all. There's a big amount down here. The the turret is doing the doing some work for us. Okay, 687, and there's still some to carry over. Uh, we still have this armor problem, and I don't really want to add to it, so we're gonna recycle, recycle this as well. Armor. Okay, we're solving that armor problem. We got big amounts of luck. Um, range is pretty nice. But I'm going to roll and see if we get... Speed is huge. We'll take it. Okay, we're going to take both of these. We've got a lot to spend here. Um, big spear upgrades. Don't think we need any more luck, though. Um, can't take this spear. Let's roll 25. Melee damage attacks me. No. I think this from the recoverables could be pretty good. Nothing here. We're, I don't really want to roll the 37. I think I'm just going to go in with the 200. I don't want to roll the 37. What do you do again? I forgot. Okay, you do this. Okay, so you actually counter some range. So getting up close and personal to you is good. Should be able to burn you down. Get rid of you as early as possible. Will be very good for us. Okay, nice. Let's dodge all of these. Let's get out of there. That is that is good. That is good. Elite down. That's going to be massive for us. Let's dodge all of these. Let's hang around the turret. The turret's always going to be useful. Some extra HP. Okay, that's painful though. The little guys really cause a problem with their... With the... The little laser balls. We want to try and get as much of the material as possible. 
Sif's Relic. Thank you. Thank you. We're taking it. That is big. We're going to take the dodge as well just to kind of help us. Um, we're going to... We could lose dodge. The Power Fist, actually pretty nice. Oh, the Power Fist. We, we probably get rid of... The, I mean, I kind of want to level up the Spear. But you know what? I think I'm just going to recycle this and bring in the Power Fist. We're not going to mess around. Let's get a top tier shotgun as well and bring you in. Let's roll 21. I'm not going to take the HP to lose some dodge. No, I'm not. I'm going to roll. There's a shotgun upgrade and we'll roll 28. Oh, so much going on here. So much going on. Do we... Okay, we lock in Spider. I think we lock in the Obliterator as well. We could take the Tentacle, but I mean, it's not really going to do much for us in terms of recovery but i think we even take this as well honestly i think we lock in everything i think we can take this we lock these in we go into wave 15. next turn's going to be huge for us sis relic brings everything to us that is such a nice item to find now we just gotta focus on clearing the wave honestly that we don't have to we just don't have to worry about picking up any of the material the days of having 300 left over, the game just knew. The game saw me struggling and was like, you know what? We're going to give you Sith Relic. You just concentrate on taking down the aliens. We will collect up the material for you. And that is dreamy. That is just what we want to see. So this is we're going to be hyper efficient with the material we pick up now. So all we have to do is focus on clearing the waves, uh, making sure that we don't die. Good dodge that come in, came in there. Try and take out as many of the little ones. Okay, 491. Tyler, recycle. Uh, ranged is gonna give us extra. Okay, spider gives us 12 damage, six attack speed for every different weapon we have. Um, so that's going to give us 18. We lose some dodge and harvesting. Or we can bring in the obliterator. I think we just bring in this for now. And then we bring in you. And we take a little extra speed. And we go to wave. We could roll the 22. The, the 22 is quite a cheap roll. Um, the shotgun is going to go. Because we're going to bring in the obliterator next time. So this is fine. Okay. Pretty good, we just get an extra, we got more attack speed, we got more damage from the spider. Uh, when we bring in the obliterator, we'll actually get even more attack speed um, because we'll be bringing in a different item for one of the shotguns. And honestly, we could rotate out of a spear for a different item as well. And we could also rotate out of another shotgun for a different item. So we could really maximize the spider. Like we've got a solid amount of luck um, so the chances of finding one of those items pretty high and we're gonna have the material to potentially pick it up because well Sif's relic is giving us a good chance rotate around all of these get in the middle just hover around our turret using the turret the best we can clear you beautiful stuff okay 406 HP I guess we'll take it um, the obliterator is coming in, so we'll recycle you, bring you in. This is always good, gives us extra. Don't want to lose the speed. Don't need the armor and HP. I guess we, I guess we could. I guess we could. We'll, we'll hold it. A little extra armor is not gonna hurt anyone. Could be pretty useful. The obliterator does a crazy amount of damage. <laughs> Thirteen hundred on crit. Wow. Like, if we build out crit and that just crits every time, I mean, it literally does obliterate. Okay, so we've got an elite next time. Um, the, the elites are the ones I'm always a little concerned about. Got to be careful with those. A little extra, a little extra HP recovery. Take you... Okay, back up the full HP again. Always nice. Work our way along. Double crit there from the obliterator. 
we're just clearing everything, but like the mater the material that is popping off, only 361, not a huge amount. Um, we'll take dodge here. And you know what? I, I'm just going to unlock this and we're just going to go into wave 18. I'm not going to take anything. Um, I'm just going to increase the chance of just saving up some money. Just try the obliterator to do the work here. Just don't want to get taken out, so I'm just going to run it round. We should be able to clear you with the obliterator. Just try and get, get in there. <laughs> Problem is, take serious damage. A little extra health. I'm just trying to charge it. I'm trying to take it down as... Getting aggressive now. Too aggressive? Oh, we got it. We got it. Okay. <laughs> I was like, we can't take it down. There's too many, but we got there. Okay, 1,000 is massive. Let's... I mean, do we need the extra XP? Probably not. Let's ricochet... I mean, yeah, we'll take it. Projectiles bounce. That's going to be pretty good for the obliterator. Um, let's roll. We should be able to get something better. Dodge here. We'll take. Okay, we don't need the spear. I'm actually looking to get out of the spear. The extra attack speed does speed up our structures a bit. But this is pretty pricey. Um, we'll take this. And honestly, I'm looking for a better weapon. That is all I'm looking for here. Um, we'll roll the 36. The spear is... It does max out the spear. I guess we'll do it. Roll. Shotgun, not interested. Roll again. Extra HP, lose a little bit of luck. Or we could take the this. I mean, 100% chance to deal if we dodge an attack. That could be pretty big. Um, we could take this as well, extra HP. You know what? I'm just going to go wave 19. I'm just going to jump in. We're going to take take on wave 19, which I think we're going to be able to do. Because now we've got ricochet, which is kind of nuts. Um, and then we should have a good amount of material. And we're going to roll down on the final turn and look for another crazy ranged weapon or melee weapon. Because... Sometimes you can find stuff which is going to cost you seven, eight hundred, um, and I want to make sure I've got that available to me if we find it. So yeah, we're going to carry we're going to carry this over. Should be should be good for this this turn. Just got to be a little careful. I don't want to don't want to lose it now after getting so far. Clear you. Let's get a little extra a little extra health. Just watch the big guys. The big guys do the damage. I mean, we haven't got a huge amount of armor. Okay, 942. We lose some crit, but we get the extra melee. I, it kind of makes sense. Big armor. You know what? I think it's probably worth taking going into the final round. Um, range damage is going to be big for melee. We get a power fist upgrade, which I'll take. And this is big for melee. And we lose a bit of the dodge, but I think this is big and we'll roll. And honestly, I think we're taking shotgun at this rate. We'll take the 37. There's a pistol. Now, is this better? 89, 44 times 4. Or do we take the skeleton, which is extra armor, crit, engineering speed? I mean, it probably is better to remove, to get rid of the shotgun. It has a little lifesteal on it. I mean, we got, we got the 7 cent lifesteal steal anyway so it doesn't actually have extra life steal 44 times four i mean i think we just keep the shotgun you know this is doing 89 straight up damage um but this is then splitting the 44 across so it does more damage if it hits uh also it has the bouncing and piercing I think we just straight up keep this and we take the exoskeleton. 
and we just go straight in to wave 20. Okay, let's go. Let's focus on one of these. Let's focus on you. Okay, you've done a runner. So now we have to focus on you. Actually, you the, the one that is rotating around is the more annoying of the two. So we will try and take you down first. Although we're probably going to get both here pretty quickly. And I'll tell you what, there it is. There is a Danger 5 Generalist run over the line. I mean, there were some hairy points going through it, but I mean, finding finding the explosive turret helped for sure. Ricochet, but I think Sis Relic was the hero because there was that one round where we lo we we carried over 300 material, but Sis Relic was there only a few rounds later for us to start mopping up. But there we have it. We have the generalist over the line, Danger 5. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, maybe like and subscribe. But thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.